What is going on guys? Today we are looking at Zachariah's Rule Breaker. He is a freestar, freestar with an upgrade of 7 on his shooting, 8 on his passing, 14 dribbling, 5 on his defending, and 5 on his physicality. He has unfortunately lost minus 4 onto his pace, which is absolutely fine, because even though you've got that, there is a magical chem style called a shadow. Takes it up to 89. Job is a good one. You end up with 93 defending as well. Taking him to a 91 CDM. That is brilliant. I think that is what this card has definitely needed. I think a minus, what, 4-3 on, on the pace is really no big deal for a big upgrade throughout. A 3-star, free 3-star, free unfortunately, I think even if he just managed to get that 4-star weak foot, that would have been absolutely sensational. But... Six foot three, high medium work rates, right footed with unfortunately no traits. We are going to be whacking the shadow on him, which like I say, takes him up to 85 acceleration and 92 sprint speed, which is fantastic. You can't argue. Um, great composure. 98 is just astonishing. Great strength and aggression. Ball control, dribbling and reactions all very, very high up there. 82 agility and 80 balance is about average for an 85 DM. I think it's relatively okay. Great short passing, long passing definitely coming up that little bit more. Good stamina, jumping's okay. Obviously with the defending, you get 95 interceptions, 77 head and accuracy, 91, 97, 99 on the defensive awareness, standing tackle, and the sliding tackle. Obviously shooting wise is not quite up there, but I think this card genuinely with a shadow looks a very, very good CDM. Probably the only person who's going to kind of keep up with him at this rate is going to be Kimmich. And again, Kimmich is fantastic. And then box to box, you're looking most definitely at my man Goretzka. So let's not waste any more time. He's coming in at about 150,000 coins at the moment. Let's see what Zachariah can do for us and see, is he worth 150? Zachariah being an absolute tower. Oh, we just run around Phil. Okay, he's done, done his bit there. He is a massive, massive player there. You, can see, you can't even miss him. He is huge. Six foot three, moves like a gazelle. You love to see it from him. Really, really nice card. I think the, the minus four on the pace, again, very much like Gundogan. Probably one of the better things they could do. With, obviously, the shadow having such an effect at a, at a plus 10, you really can't be too angry that they've got it. That was a beautiful fake from De Bruyne. We can see him pushing up the line here. Can we feed that ball in? It's absolutely brilliant. It's going to go for the fake. Knocks it across, but unfortunately, Frederick is there. Zachariah mopping up. Gets a little through ball into Pizzy. It's going to try one more into Rafa, but unfortunately not. Can we? Ah, I was going to say, can we find a bit of Zachariah in there? Unfortunately, the pass was mislaid, and we've left it far too long to get that through ball in. But we do manage to win it back pretty instantaneously there. Zachariah coming in, steps in with the strength. Unfortunately, Lukaku's going to come in with his own strength, really trying to bring him down, and Zachariah makes sure he does not go anywhere with that ball. Zachariah pushing. He's going to get out pushed by Foden there. Very interesting to see. Obviously, the strength levels are a bit different in them sort of aspects. Going to find him again. Go with a little dink over the top. Obviously, short pass is better for him. Does manage to find it. Can we find him back on the edge? Unfortunately, the pass is not going to be able to be completed after this stage. And again, with him pushing forward straight down the middle. Obviously, doesn't have the four-star skills, so you always got to be a bit wary. And again, he's going a bit too far. We will have him just as a, a stay at the DM, really. So it is kind of interesting to see what he's like actually going forward. Because pretty much most of the time, I would personally have him as a stay back DM. As you can see, interceptions on point there. Unfortunately, unable to do anything with it. We find Mbappe just steams through. And it's a great save from Lloris. Zachariah in the right spot. Finds him in. And I don't know why he's gone through his legs. Zachariah going for it again. Unfortunately, it was the perfect ball through, but I don't know what kind of let Mbappe just knock it through his legs. I must have been holding RB or something, and again, just missing out. Good take from Zachariah again, putting the pressure on the attack. He is just that big unit, and I don't know why he's kind of pushing forward. I may not have him on stay back whilst attack, because he definitely should be staying back whilst attacking, and Larice with another great save. Zachariah making sure he's number one there. Looking for the ball into Mbappe. Solid work. Goes for the finesse. And Lopez now being number one. Zachariah is going to turn a little bit. 
He has, to be fair to him, for such a big player, he has got a nice little turning circle on him. Again, not, not necessarily incredible, but I mean, it definitely could be worse. <laughs> Zachariah leading the attack out, gets the one touch. Thought I was going to be taken down, but we've managed to find it to the wing. It's very, very nice. Just whip a ball in. Mbappe is getting his head there, but unfortunately, I think misses out. Zachariah just looking for that wing pass there. And Kunku's going to come across. Ah, and Pavard's going to just dispossess him like he's absolutely nothing. Zachariah getting rid of it again. Looking down wing. That's a cracking pass into Tom. And again, dispossessing Conte like he's nothing. That's a fantastic little bit of defending from him. And again, interceptions this time. A little bit of flair. Love to see a little uh, roulette every now and then. Zachariah, great last man interception. We did have somebody on Cruyff, but you never know with Cruyff. He just pops up every now and then and just delivers a masterclass. So to not let it get to him, perfect. And that was awful. Zachariah delivering the ball. And again, Tom messing up, but not what you need in that final third. And again, he just manages to find it. This time he finds it, and this time it's Mbappe. So going into the overall for Zachary, then he's coming in at 130 at the moment. Dropped down 20k from the past, what, 30, 30-ish minutes? And more than likely will creep down as we go forward. Um, I'm interested to see what Gundogan is actually now, because he was about 150 as well. He he's dropped loads down under a hundred now. That is absolutely crazy how quickly he's gone. And obviously Tom is now 14k, which is just nuts. But we more than likely will see them kind of up and down through the night. Obviously at the moment there is a lot of demand, so the supply is kind of there by the looks of things. I felt I thought the supply would actually be rather dry if anything. But looks like we have got a little bit of supply in the market there just to get them because we have no league SBCs. Gold upgrades are the only thing, and obviously we I don't think we had any extra lightning um promo packs because they were all yesterday so unless people have left them which by the looks of things it has and i think this card is actually fantastic he's got a really nice balance as soon as you whack that shadow on him you've got the 89 pace which is really good obviously the acceleration could be better but i mean sprint speed does keep it afloat great de uh, defending on him his dribbling is actually not that bad agility balance coming in at average but everything else coming in at a very high standard same with his strength and aggression both of them being over 90 is fantastic 86 stamina really can't complain about that one great short pass long pass with some decent stuff overall looking fantastic i think most definitely he is a very very good card and i think once he drops under 100 he's going to be absolutely prime for a bundesliga team i really think the only card that's going to even come close to him is probably this kimmich and even then i just don't know if he could compare that correctly really like 173k to 100 you look at both of them with a shadow if we can find both with a shadow here uh, so if you look at both of them obviously Zachariah wins on pace defending is only one off so can't really give him that physical is nine plus yes Kimmich's passing is better but then you've obviously got better dribbling from Zachariah and he's cheaper the only thing I think that he is missing out on is that four star weak foot other than that this is an absolutely fantastic card overall wise I'm going to give him a solid nine out of ten I think for right now in the Bundesliga it's exactly what they're looking for in terms of a midfield you're looking at Kimmich you're looking at to be honest Royce uh, Verts and Kunku is incredible obviously you've got Ricken, Zachariah, Zab uh, Zabit Sabitza. I don't know why I struggled to say that name then. But overall, I do. I think he's CDM-wise is the best, if not one of the best, in the Bundesliga at the moment. Definitely check him out if you've got a chance. If you've got his 83, then definitely kind of go up for this 85. I feel like he definitely will be a good replacement for him. Like and subscribe on this video, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace.